Yo, 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 guys, it's Side News here today. And I got, uh, what, four booster packs. I got three Tactical Masters, and I got one of the Grand Creators. And I'm going to put them up against these uh, scam packs from Walmart. I wanted to see which which packs will give me the best cards. Like, can I get better cards out of the scams, or can I get better cards out of the actual booster packs? It's 40 cards versus what there is seven in all of these. One, two, three, four, that's 28. All right, yeah, 28. 28 against 40. The odds, don't know. Pricings, there's a lot of good cards in these. Um, I can get scapegoat, and scapegoat's probably the only one I really want. That's such a funny card. Um, summons four uh, tokens. Um, that's really about it, but there is some good pricings in there. Um, what else was there? I forget. Uh, if I see it, I'll remember. And these, I'm not sure what I can get. It's 20 random cards. Move this a little bit closer to me. Up. Uh, um. I'll start off with these. And we are opening the Grand Creators. Shake it. It's the only Grand Creators that was left. That's one through three, right? Oh, yeah, it is. Uh, we got Rise Bell, the Star Adjuster, and Zector Centipede, Exo Sister, something, and Zector Sword. Um, how do you pronounce that? Zach Caliber? And Zector Ladybug, Exo Sister. That is, hey, an insect imitation. Not too bad, not too bad. Go through the pricings of those later. Try not to damage any cards. I hopefully, um, I can't even pick them off my table. God damn. Move these over to the side. Boom, next. Get a tactical master out of here. If it will come off, you know. Oh, I just want to pull some good cards. I want to be able to add these into a deck. Oh. Maybe I'll make a video of building a deck. Not my strong suit. Let's see. Make some pretty bad decks. So we got a bear blocker. We got, come on, man, these are too shiny for me to read. Um, something Archer, yeah, that's where we'll go. Runic, Flashing Fire. Uh, and, oh, Anti-Spell Fragrance, yes, 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 that's a card that's uh, worth something. Farewell, Welcome Labyrinth. Absolute King Black Jack. Invader of Darkness. <laughs> Your opponent cannot activate quick play spells. That's a that's kind of a dick move, man. Anti spell fragrance is a good card. I like that card. It's pretty much making spell cards, trap cards. <laughs> That's awesome. Most decks run on spell cards, so. Bad. But it's only quick play spells, though, so. Not. I don't know. I don't know. Might come in handy. 
Okay, on to the second Statical Master. Hey, Runic Dispelling. Ooh. Pendulum Switch. Ooh. That'd be good for a Pendulum deck, right? I don't know much about Pendulums. Runic Freezing Curses. Um, Fair Welcome Labyrinth. Another anti spell fragrance. Um, we got Labyrinth, Trend, Dragal. Oh, why are these all? Oh, Reckless Greed. Yeah, th these are tongue twisters, man. But Reckless Greed, draw two cards, get the next two draw phases. Actually, you know, kind of terrible card. Especially if you have, like, put in, like, a deck that needs a lot of drawing. Not a bad card. And we shall go into this. The last Catacomb Masters. I do like the artwork on this, though. Look at this. I love the big sword. Mustache. Looks like a I don't know what she is. Is she a waifu? Yeah, it's a waifu. And this guy's like, he's an archer. Okay, last pack. Good luck. Got some weight to this one. Maybe there is something good in this one. And we start off with. Ah, uh, oh, that's the guy in the front of the package. Say on the. Valiant Archer, that's the Archer guy, Ninja guy, Labyrinth, Rune, Runic Slumber, and Priestess Girl, Invader of Darkness, Imperial, Iron Wall, <laughs> neither player can banish cards. Not terrible. That'd be good against Call of the Grave. Nice. Now, on to these bad boys. Oh, I hit my camera. Oh. Stop unfocusing. Center. Thank you, camera. I need a better camera. I'm using a phone right now. <laughs> Okay. Move this to the C. Focus. C. Achiever. Token Sunday. Chaos Infinity. We got Reboot. We got Mechlord Emperor Grinnell. Neo, the um, Magic Swordsman. This is a interesting card. Mechlord Army of Liberal. Mechlord Portrait. Oh, don't like that. Uh, halfway to Forever. Go, 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 Giant. Mind Protector. Gaia the Fierce Knight. Ah, this is a iconic card from the original Yu-Gi-Oh. Gaia the Dragon Champion. Another iconic card. Shift. Ah. When your opponent attack targets exactly one monster you control, and no other cards for attack. Oh, there's another monster you control, and that would be an appropriate target. <laughs> nice. The Eye of Truth. Nice, Die of Truth is a great card. <gasps> Magical hat. Now this, man, probably one of my favorite like trap cards that I've seen in Yu like the original Yu-Gi-Oh. They were just iconic to have around. I love it. Black Luster Ritual. Nice. Now that that's good for uh, I the Magical Mist. 
Damn. Seven and eight, yes. <gasps> multiply. I actually wanted this because I have dead and eight already. I needed to multiply. Oh, this is great. Great. Towards my Karibos. And then I got Burning Land. <laughs> nice. Burning Land. Oh, I'm happy. I got quite a few cards that I like. Probably nothing, nothing worth anything, but I'll have to go through the pricing. I'm trying to take some time. <laughs> no, I, you know what? I don't mind these at all. Okay, get the garbage out of the way. So we got Keeper of Dragon Magic. What does this card do? This, oh. There's normal or special summon. You can discard one card. Add one polymerization, normal spell card, or fusion normal spell card from your deck to your hand. You can reveal one fusion monster in your extra deck. Special summon one of the fusion materials you name it. You listed on that master from your graveyard and face down the fence position. You can only use the effect to keep of dragon magic once per turn. Hey, this is a limited edition. Okay. Okay. Be careful of that. I didn't know. Okay. Mausoleum of White. Okay. I'm assuming. Decent beacon of white. Oh, okay. This is for this is like blue eye support. Lantern shark. You know what? Awkward water water fish monster thing in my bob. They're actually like if you make a deck, they're actually not bad. They can be pretty useful. And the new like marine sets stuff. They're pretty powerful. If you can use them correctly. Um something spiral galaxy, yeah. I'm not reading these. <laughs> if I spiral discharge. Yeah, I can read that. Yeah, yeah. Uh Curse of Dragon, the Cursed Dragon. Oh my. Not too bad. Infernoble Infernable. Infernable Knight something. The warrior. Ah, AI. Is that a Q? That is a Q. That's for an addict. Mr. Monster. Okay. I don't know much about those. I really don't. I should probably uh, do more research into them. Formable Turn Trooper. Hey! Pilgrim Reaper. Melfi, mommy, um, okay, Melfi tag. <laughs> Abaki, that, that is hilarious. Oh, it's this guy, this is kind of cool. Like who said, <laughs> that is hilarious. I like this. Needlebug Nest. Oof. Morphotronic Scramble. Hey, Morphotronics aren't too bad. Morphotronic Force Field. Okay. Oh, Donald Wrestler Chimera T. Something. Uh. Hiplex. Oh. Chimera. And number 40, Gimmick Puppet of Strings, actually. Gimmick Puppets are pretty good. Um, well, if I, I'm going to put a bet here. I'm assuming, I really want to assume that Booster Packs gave me, uh, my money somewhat worth back. And these Scam Packs 
like screwed me over. But we shall see when I do the math and add it in. Anyway, this has been your boy Saigus, and um, this was my first trial of Stamp Pack versus Booster Packs. And uh, well, let's see how that goes.